Welcome to the Microsoft Dynamics AX 2012 R3 demo on serial number validation. In today's demo, we will go over the setup for printing serial numbers, set up tracking of serial numbers in the sales process, and complete the delivery of sales orders with serialized items. Let's begin. Before you begin, you must specify that serial numbers should be printed on the packing slip and on the invoice. Make sure the packing slip tab is selected and the serial number checkbox is checked. We've now completed the setup for serial number printing. Serial number tracking has been set up for the video projector T0006 so that serial numbers are tracked only in the sales and return processes. Make sure the T0006 video projector is highlighted and click enter. Serial numbers are not tracked in inventory for this setup. That is, the serial number tracking dimensions is not active. This means that although serial numbers can be registered when items are sold and returned, you cannot identify the serial numbers that are on hand. Verify that on-hand inventory is not counted by serial number and that serial number information is not available in the on-hand form for the T0006 video projector. Contoso Entertainment System Germany is selling five video projectors to Southridge Video, DE016. When preparing the delivery, one serial number unfortunately could not be read because the serial number label has fallen off the box. Notice that the serial numbers 114321, 114322, 114323, and 114325 are printed under the line with the five video projectors. After sending the package with the five video projectors to the customer, the missing serial number label is found on the floor in the shipping department. When creating the invoice, the list of serial numbers can be updated to include the missing number. Notice that all five serial numbers, 114321 through 114325, are printed under the line with the five video projectors.
In addition to the corrected invoice, the missing serial number 114234 has also been updated on the packing slip.